to live all my life, I think, in uh, Europe, but I want to be some uh, years in uh, America. Let's say uh, um, uh, Vancouver. For now, Europe 100% because of my family, friends and everything else. So yes, as well. I would go for Europe. I'm, I'm still happy where I live. In uh, Europe. For me, it's an easy choice. Like, I've been to America, I've been to Asia, so... <laughs> Bigger house in a smaller city. Yes, a lot in the in the big city. Prefer to live in the in the campaign in the big house with my kids, my family. We'd probably go for the villa in the country uh, side. A villa with a garden in the countryside because I enjoy like having uh, peaceful surroundings. Oof. Uh... A huge garden, of course. Everything. <laughs> I'm joking. So like. Uh... A uh, big pool, I would say. Oh, that's a cool. That's that's quite tough. Um, a huge pool. <laughs> I can have a can have a huge pool close to the sea, and uh, it's uh, making a balcony. As <laughs> As I always lived in France, in the southeast, where it's pretty, where the weather is always pretty great. I would go for the big pool uh, because it might suggest that I have a big garden as well. A huge pool. I mean, who doesn't want a pool? But... <laughs> Yeah, we'll say rooftop. Why not? <laughs> Why not? You can have a good, <laughs> a good view when you where you are playing. It's it's very nice. Rooftops. I like to be high. No. <laughs> a rooftop, 100%. And every time I want to buy a apartment or whatever, the thing that I look is like this view. I'd say the rooftop because I like uh, I like a bit of sunlight coming into my room. You know, don't like it being full dark. When it comes to the basement, uh, first of all, you're liking of light. And I always like to to have the light, to have the sunlight going through my windows. Uh, so that's important. And the rooftop, it might be really warm in summer. So uh, I, I think the first floor is the is the right middle. Uh, I'd say sound system I can control. Huge uh, sound uh, system, yeah. Yeah, nice sound. I song, I think, when I can put uh, my music, what I uh, what I want, and to dance, to chill with my boys, I think it's the best. Uh, having fans, I would say, because we are spending a lot of time in our rooms and uh, playing a lot. I would go with the lights. Uh, I'm really someone to be in an environment that looks pretty, I would say, and I think lights makes the makes a really big difference when it comes to the the whole design of a room, you know. For sure, the first one. It's so annoying to do some to do some course, you know, in the market to, to buy Baby Bell and uh, stuff. No need to go to the groceries and always have full full fridge. But I don't need to buy a grocery. <laughs> I think it's the change of temperature. If I can have a place where the temperature always fits what I want, it would be it would be the perfect way. And <laughs> no need to control lights because I get up uh, so many times off the bed uh, just to turn off around the lights. So. <laughs> I would go for the start uh, for the for the smart living room because I, I I tend to have a lot of guests, so it will help them as well, you know. Bedroom because uh, the sleep is important. <laughs> I actually go for a smart kitchen because I'm not the most uh, handy guy in the kitchen, so I would need some help. Smart kitchen, smart kitchen. I don't know a machine, and you put just some ingredients and paf, let's go, baby. You have the. Your, your diner uh, directly. Oh, the voice control. The voice control is really uh, next generation, I would say. Yeah, uh, we say the voice. Voice. Voice control. Voice control. I want to speak with my house, and uh, if I want to tell something to do it, uh, she do it. How I call my house? Hmm. I call it uh, you get. You get. It's a. It's a. It's a girl uh, in the in France. It's like uh, old mom, you know. No FPS drop because recently I got a new PC and uh, it's making a huge difference to don't have a FPS drop. Your game is like really, really nice to play. No FPS drops. <laughs> you can mute uh, toxic players anytime you want, but if you got FPS problems, <laughs> there's no help. 
the FPS job is the worst thing you can have at CS. I think uh, you cannot control that huge amount of people, so you cannot control the fact that people are, are toxic. It is what it is. I think not toxic players is the most important thing, because if you have good players in your team and people who are not toxic, life is easier. No toxic players. Ah, because toxic players, you can lose, uh, you can lose every game with toxic players. Even if you play good and the team play good, one guy, if he's toxic, he can uh, shut down all the team. And he's bad. So, like, no toxic players is good choice. And I have that in, in G2. I mean, I don't have toxic players. So it's all fine. Everything else we fix.